Sports company a Fanatic scoring a new deal with the NHL. The merchandise giant will replace Adidas uh, as the league's uniform and jersey outfitter here now with more on the deal in all things sports. Michael Rubin, CEO of Fanatics, Gary Bettman, our friend, commissioner uh, of the National Hockey League. You, you already uh, built, you, you already were manufacturing a lot for, for the NHL. You just didn't have a, a, a any, any uh, logo on the, on the uniform. Yeah, we've been in business with NHL since 2005. Nearly 20 years, had an incredible partnership, and this was really the next leg for us to go from making all of the breakaway jerseys, which is really the fan jersey, to making the authentic jerseys. We're super excited about it. We make a lot of performance products today, and hockey's an incredibly strategic partnership for us, and one that we're really uh, excited just to expand. Another addition to the stable, isn't it? I mean, it, it, what, what do but you do? But it's a really, but it's a really baseball. But, you make all the uniforms. We, we do make all the uniforms. The Nike ba branded baseball. uniforms you make too, don't we you? We do, but this is a really strategic uh, expansion for us. Hockey's a big business for us, and we're excited to have the Fanatics logo on the uniforms. It's incredible exposure for us. It's a way for us to continue to build the brand. So this is a big move for us. He, he said it all. <laughs> you know, we're excited. We've got a great partnership. Yeah. And, and frankly, when you're in business with Michael, he is just the force of nature. And we have had a partnership that's been very broad-based and encompassing e-commerce, retail, uh, performance, fan-friendly merchandise, uh, whole everything across the spectrum. This was the next logical step for us in being in business together. And we have complete confidence that they're going to do a great job. What's, what's better about it than the Adidas deal? It, it's different. And Adidas, a good partner, but they're more focused on soccer and footwear. We're a little bit different. And Michael and Fanatics cover the broad spectrum of everything we're doing. And we've had together pretty dramatic double-digit growth over the last few years. So we love the partnership. Uh, we think Fanatics does a great job in everything they do. Michael's extremely progressive and forward-thinking. He's a visionary, and he can execute, and that's the most important thing in you want from your partner. In terms of marketing to fans, in terms of making sure it's available in a lot of different places? He does it all, especially on things like special events, Stanley Cup final merchandise, when we do uh, our big events like the Winter Classic and our other outdoor games. They do it all. Look, we wake up and go to bed thinking about how do we best service the fan. And when you have a company that, that's 100% of its business comes from taking care of the sports fan, we're going to do the best job. And that's really what we aspire to do every day. And, you know, I think we've made a lot of progress over the past 18 years, and we're just getting started at the same time. What was the temperature when we were together at that? You remember that last Winter Classic? Yeah, it was cold. It was like 10 below. You, you were shivering. <laughs> well, it was 10 below, and we were outside. We were outside, too, but it was a lot of fun. Um, to, so... I don't know what you guys discuss before you come on, but do either of you have any thoughts about regional sports and how this plays out? You, you both, you, you could, you could buy everything probably if well, you want. Is that ever something you? Well, first and foremost, we're a hundred percent focused on the three businesses that we're in today. We have a. You know, big and growing merchandise business, which we call Fanatics Commerce. We have our collectibles business, where we just started the trading cards business 15 months ago. We actually started taking our first bets in gaming just two weeks ago, which we have big aspirations for. So we have our hands full. We're very focused. I will give Gary credit. I came to him two years ago and asked about the RSNs, and he said, Michael, be patient. Um, you know, there's, there's a lot to unfold there's here. There's so much value there, but it's anything. not. It, it, the